Good morning, everyone. God has decided to let me live another day. I realized I should have included this earlier in the video, and here's just another snippet from Editing Press. Um, disclaimer, this COVID test that was a part of the vlog was not being done because I had COVID or because I thought I had COVID. If I thought I had COVID, I wouldn't have filmed it. I wouldn't have taken Avery with me. We wouldn't have gone to Ross. This COVID test was only done as a precaution to the colonoscopy. Like it had to be done beforehand or else I wouldn't have been able to go get my colonoscopy. Just wanted to make that clear. I didn't want to stir the pot or anything. It, the test was negative. It just letting y'all know I wasn't putting anybody at risk. Okay, thanks, hope you enjoyed the video, love you, bye. I am about to go on a little journey. I have to go get COVID tested for my colonoscopy. I simply forgot to call around and see where I could get it done, you know, in my hometown. So I have to drive an hour away and get on three separate highways just to go get COVID tested. And you guys are coming with me. We are at the COVID test tent, which is a little scary because no one's here. And I... I mean, we have another 15 minutes till my actual quote appointment. Good morning, Avery. Good morning. It's early. <laughs> it is early. So I think I will wait for another 10 minutes, then call, and then get my nostril swabbed, and I will let you know how it goes. Okay, and also, whoever decided that I had to get on three different highways just to get my nose and brain touched, God is just testing me today. We'll see you after it's done, cause probably can't record it. I have my phone on my speedometer thingy. We are Spit waiting on her. Thingy. We're waiting for the people to come out and test me. I'm getting nervous. But we're first in line. We're first in line and I don't feel bad at all because I was the first one here. But at the same time, I kind of feel bad. Oh I'm already having a panic attack <laughs> because I'm getting my nose swabbed and then the, <laughs> the cherry on top was do you want to go to Ross? <laughs> After my grandpa calling me three separate times, <laughs> me getting on three separate highways, and then just sprinkles added was, do you want to go to Ross? Can I get right there so we can get like a nostril here? Get the nostril shots. My pits are sweating significantly more than they were beforehand. <laughs> This girl's 19, she's going to a pediatric facility. What's she doing here? They told me they won't let me go till I feel better. Vlogging and driving except Abley, Abley. <laughs> Abley. Except Avery's holding it. And the COVID test wasn't even that bad. She was so nice. She was like, I'm only going to the bridge, okay? They yeah. felt so good. Hashtag relieved, hashtag I'm a new woman. Hashtag you wanna go get donuts? Oh my God, that looks so good. You wanna go get donuts, dead ass? Dead ass, sure. Yeah. Okay. Woo! Got COVID tested, wearing my Skims mask. Thank you, Kim Kardashian. Thank you, Avery, for blowing a cloud of vape. Got COVID tested, now it's just a girl's day at this point. We're at Shipley's Donuts, I wanna try it, and I'm hungry. Avery's stomach hurts, so we need to eat anyways. We've never been here before, mostly because we live in the smallest town in Texas. I could have ordered by now, but I'm waiting for Avery. Shipley's Donut vlog haul, huh? what did you get? I got a chocolate sprinkle because I'm a basic bitch. They taped my box. <laughs> and I'm starving because... Oh. She forgot her cherry, didn't you? Yeah, she forgot my cherry. It's fine. It's fine. I got a bullseye. Oh. I guess it's quite literally a bullseye. It's like a donut hole. In the... Oh, it is. Yeah. They didn't take out the hole. And a strawberry because I am a <laughs> for strawberry donuts. I've never had a strawberry donut. I'm my favorite. This is literally the most regular donut I've ever had. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was cheap though. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's like donut icing, but this is like cake icing. It's a little bit too sweet. Mm. Is it like, you wanna try it? No. Okay. <laughs> In the nicest sense, I don't like cake icing, so. 
It's like buttercream. Oh, I hate buttercream. I, dude, I hate cake icing. Like, I like the cake itself. <laughs> What? <laughs> Napkin. So my new medication makes me prone to fainting. <laughs> Which I just realized I never told you, but I told dad and dad was like, it's so rare though. And I'm like, and I am the rarity most of the time. <laughs> like from my little pony. When the COVID test nurse came up to the car, I locked the door. <laughs> like, she, like she was gonna attack me. No. Nah. Please keep that in. Girls Day with Avery and Press. I thought about making the COVID test part of the colonoscopy vlog, but it's gonna end up being another 45 minute video if I do that. Let's go get some protein and then get Gibby his protein. And then I'm not vlogging on the highway because it's not safe. Two, I don't want to post my panic attack on YouTube. And three, last time I was vlogging and driving, my aunt yelled at me. <laughs> I wasn't even vlogging and driving. Avery was holding the phone and I was just talking. It was essentially a civilized conversation caught on camera. When was that? During the Princess Fiona video when we went to Taco Bell. I got in trouble. I forgot we went to Taco Bell. Yeah. They were like, why are you using your phone and driving? I was like, Avery is holding the phone. Like I said, just a recorded conversation. So what is that? Content. Mukbang, mukbang. How do you say it? Mukbang. Oh. Avery's first time trying Death Bros. What do you think? Good. I literally uh, felt like I was playing lottery. Avery got really overwhelmed. <laughs> really overwhelmed. First of all, the two ladies at the drive-thru though were very so pretty. hot. Oh, I am very gay. So tell them what you got. I got a dirty chai with vanilla and soft top. And one shot of espresso. Which is what the dirty chai part is. Oh, I didn't know that. Um, I felt like an idiot ordering. <laughs> the ladies came up and they were like, hi, what do you want? And I was like, can I have a Glacier Peak iced? And she was like, yeah, is the soft top fine? I was like, yeah, that's fine. And it turns to Avery. <laughs> and I said, can I have a dirty chai? How many shots of espresso? One, I guess. Do you want soft top? Sure. Do you want any flavoring? <laughs> Vanilla. <laughs> I felt like I was, like, just very overwhelmed very quickly. But it's worth it. Mm -hmm. If it makes you feel any better, the first time me and Michaela came here, like, they don't have a speaker for the drive through Yeah. So we sat there for, like, five minutes. We were like, maybe we just pull forward. And we pulled forward, and we were like, maybe we should put it in reverse and go back. Maybe there's a hidden speaker. So we pull up, and they were like, how can I take your order? And we were like, oh, thank God. I got an Ice Glacier Peak. Yeah. Ice Glacier Peak Rebel. It has soft top on top. And if I won't spill it, it also has sugar, like, granules. This is a heart attack in a cup, but. What flavor is it? No idea. <laughs> Green. Look how bubbly it is. Pretty. Here, hold the hand. Ah! Why cold? Iron deficient. I am also iron deficient, not that cold. Actually, okay. Let me put that on your keloid. She picked her keloid. So, cold make feel better. I was about to say that thing is leaking right now. <laughs> not to be disgusting but also to be disgusting. Is. We got our Dutch Bros, we're about to go to Pet Supplies Plus and because, Ross. and maybe Ross, Avery is on a Ross kick. I, I don't really know what, wanna go to Ross. I don't know what happened. I just really wanna go to Ross. I haven't been to Ross in a fat minute. Okay, so Pet Supplies Plus and then Ross. Me and Avery are at Ross and she pulled out this. Little, it's mm -hmm. like a two piece little jumper thing. And I was like, oh my gosh, Kim Kardashian has a collection like that. And tell me what the hell did you say? I said, Press, I love you. But I have realized that you relate everything back to Kim K. And it's like the global conspiracy of Kim Kardashian. <laughs> and I was not wrong. I found your pair of jeans for the gay people. And the safety buckle when you feel unsafe. The only amount of pride is the fucking buckle. 
I didn't like this thing. It's better than none at all, B word. We just got done shopping. Um, I had to pee violently <laughs> in Ross, and we went and we looked for a restroom, and there was not one. So, Anywhere. yeah. Had to walk two stores down to Old Navy, and I almost peed myself. Avery wants to do a little haul, and I'll show you guys my haul as well. Start it out in uh, cute, fuzzy mushroom hoodie uh, that says, make your own, or own your magic on the sleeve. Uh, cute little silky shirt, giving very Prince Charming vibes. I I'm said correct. Courtney Kardashian. Uh, cute shirt that says to the moon and never back as I cover my face with the shirt. Um, cute Michelangelo shirt because I am the art kid. Uh, and it says genius is eternal patience on the side. Cute sun and moon shirt that matches eye color. <laughs> Mushroom MTV. Mushroom MTV. All that needs to be said. In case you can't tell, Avery does shroom. I <laughs> just do not do just shroom. Just kidding. And then magic mushroom shirt. Because I really like mushrooms. I don't do them because shrooms are bad, kids. Also, the AC is on blast because it is December in Texas and it is 80 degrees outside. It is hot today. Disgusting. Disgusting. I only got two things from Ross. I found the Hello Kitty shirt. Yay! Yay. Found this knockoff Juicy Couture tracksuit. No, not tracksuit. Hoodie? No, jacket? Yeah. Jack cropped jacket. Crop jacket. I like it. We were gonna get matching ones, but but Avery ditched me. No, I just have a uh she has her set aesthetic. No, I have a pack that if I ever wear anything with the phrase... <laughs> I'm so sorry. If I ever wear anything with the phrase baby girl on it, people are to put me in a hospital because I am obviously going through something that I can't deal with on my Wait, so do you think I'm mentally ill because I got that? No, if I ever wore it because I don't think I would ever wear something with the phrase baby girl or angel. I just like it because I thought it'd look cute with like leggings and my white holographic night. I, I was about to say Nike's like Wendy Williams. She's talking about her mom and she has also died. She's also died. Yeah. And I was about to say Nike like Nike. I thought the crop little hoodie would look cute with leggings. My Nike's. You know, just very Y2K, very Regina Georgia. We'll give you Gibby's um, enclosure update when we get home. It's there is hair. <laughs> we'll see you when we get home. Me and Avery made it back home. Say hi, Ave. And I set up Gibby's new tank. Tank tour. It's huge for his tiny little frog body. There he is. I'm about to give him his warm worm. I have it up here because I was scared that I was going to kill it. See if he'll eat it. And he better. Look, new food to fatten you up. Yay! We got it! Good job, Gibby. Presley filming at a terrible angle at 3 in the morning. You know what that means. I'm in a pickle. Just my luck. My colonoscopy got rescheduled. My GI doctor told me that they wanted me to finish my round of meds. And I'll come in the week after my original colonoscopy was scheduled. And then we'll get it done. So, they just wanted me to feel a little better. But also, essentially, I got my COVID test done for no reason. <laughs> I have to go get it done again. Maybe I'll make another YouTube video about it. COVID test round two. That's what I'm gonna call the next video. Yeah, I was just trying to find a way to end this video without making it feel like it got cut short, but it did. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the colonoscopy vlog. Bye. <laughs>